Hi boys and girls. Today I wanted to share with you the book titled Violet's Music and it's by Angela Johnson. When Violet was a baby, just a few hours old, she banged her rattle against the crib, hoping others in the nursery would join in. Boom, shake, beat, shake all day long. Violet played that rattle. Could she find other babies to play along? No, she couldn't, but she'd keep looking. Violet played her music all alone. On Violet's second birthday, Aunt Bertha brought gifts and a box full of paper crayons, glitter, and glue to make horns that would wail. Violet tooted from morning till that night. Wah woo woo all day long. She tried to get everyone to toot with her all day. Wah woo woo, oh yeah, Violet blew that horn. Could she get her family to play with her? No, she couldn't, but she'd keep on looking. Violet blew her horn all alone. Violet wa wondered in kindergarten if there were other kids like her who dreamed music, thought music, all day long. But she found that some liked to paint, some liked to paste, others liked to play in the sandbox, and still others just liked to stand around eating paste. Oh my. No one wanted to play music all day long. One day at the beach, Violet played with a badminton racket, a pretend guitar, hoping someone would join in. Plink, plink, pluck, pluck, Violet played guitar. She Could she find a fellow guitarist buried in the sand? No, she couldn't, but she'd keep looking. Violet played her guitar all alone. With Violet, you see, it was music all the time. Breakfast time, dinner time, bath time, and all times in between. Whenever she walked down the street or hid behind the market's vegetable bins or sat on the fire escape, Violet was always looking for kids like her. Could she find them at the zoo? Nope. At the museum? Too quiet. And forget about the dentist. But she'd keep looking. Violet and her music always looking. Until one day, a few summers later, Violet was playing her guitar. Violet was playing her guitar, a real one now, in the park. Twang, twang, yeah, yeah, twang, twang, yeah. When over by the fountain, someone started beating a drum. Then behind the jungle gym, a saxophone blew real smooth. And over beside the flower garden, someone started to sing. And now Angel, Randy, and Juan are in Violet's band. And if you ask any of them whether they thought they'd find each other, they'll say, oh yeah, we did. We knew we would, cause we 
when we were in the nursery, then were two, and later in kindergarten and at the beach, we kept on looking for kids playing music too. And they found each other because music was their thing. Shake, twang, plink, pluck, wah, woo, yeah. Love to know what you think about this story, boys and girls. And uh, something special maybe you love that you would love to find other people to share it with. Have a great day.